new environment. Uh, like completely everything was very new to me. And at the same time, I was quite bored being the only child of my parents. I was so sad. I even used to call up my parents uh, almost every day. And I cry over the phone. I want to come home, I want to come home like that. And that time, I was not that hard working. I was an average student. And for me, getting pass mark was good. And if I luckily get a little above pass mark, that was excellent, that's it. I had no ambition, I had no such targets like that. I want to be this, I want to be that. I was that kind of person before I went to Patkai. But as soon as I started attending my classes, one particular subject, philosophy, <clears throat> it really caught my attention. And I changed overnight from that no ambition student, that lazy student, to hardworking, sincere student. So how is that? Was about. It was because of my teacher. This particular subject, the teacher, the subject teacher, he's still my teacher, even in my PhD, he was my poor guy. So this particular teacher, he's so interesting, you know. His teachings were very clear, understandable, and he tries to uh, make every topic as interesting as possible. There's really uh, no chance for us to get bored uh, about his lectures. And another very good thing I saw about his, him is timing. He'll be at least five minutes ahead of the class, ahead of the start of the class. And he'll be waiting there, cheerfully waiting for us to come in. And he'll be there to greet us. And another thing is, during my five years stay at Patkai, he never missed a single class. So, me and my friends, we used to joke sometimes, like, don't he ever get sick? At least he should get sick once a year, so that at least we get some free time, free class like that. But he will never miss his class. You will always see him cheerful, smiling, ready to help, when you have some questions, when you sometimes